In times of a crisis, that most British of solutions, putting the kettle on and having a nice cup of tea. But research claims the daily cupper is not just nice, it's also a stress buster, with a single cup significantly reducing anxiety. The psychologist behind the research at London City University, Dr Malcolm Cross, says everything about the making and drinking of tea is good for tackling stress. It's not just the drinking of the tea, I think it's the ritual that's associated with it. So taking time out. Um, taking a break and actually physically making tea or having it made for you really does have potential benefits. And the experts say it's the drink's very Britishness and its association with the Queen that all adds to the tea's calming effects. During the research, volunteers were placed in a stressful scenario. Those that were not given tea saw a 25% increase in stress levels. Those that had a cup saw levels drop by 4%. But it seems us Brits would enjoy a cup of tea regardless of any added health benefits. I'm a big fan of tea. I must admit, I had a cup of tea this morning and one here. I'm not sure if it de-stresses me making it, but if someone's made it for me, definitely de-stressed. I think it's the, the fact that you put uh, water in the kettle, you boil that, it gives you time to, I think, think. I'm not sure that the drink itself is de-stressing. I think it's the action of doing it. I think just the sound of the kettle in the morning probably just kind of relaxes you because you know that you're going to get this nice cup of tea and you can sit down and just kind of, I don't know, it's a time to just sit and relax I guess, time to reflect on the day or what's coming up. I think it's the whole sort of tradition of you have to wait for the pot to warm and, and then you pour your tea and just wait it's all a soothing and it, it, it's a nice soothing way of getting through and obviously some of the teas are themselves soothing and they do actually work. It is by far Britain's most popular drink and we get through 165 million cups of it every day. So what better excuse for that tea break if it stops us all going a bit stir-crazy?